Okay, so this is another little quick one, just a quick tip. So say you've got some tires like these, which are tiny, and you've got the rubber, um, you've got the foam inserts on the inside, if you can see them. If you can see that, I don't know if you can, it's a bit difficult. But sometimes when you put them in, they have difficulty filling out around the edges, around the top, where it's against the rubber. So the quickest way I like to do it is to re reinflate the tyre, or the sponge rather, and to pad it out into the tyre completely, is to just drop it into some hot water I've just boiled in the kettle. It's probably not the best idea, I don't know if people do this or not, but I do. I find that doing this it also helps clean the tyres, but also helps the sponge to because of the sudden heat, sort of change in heat will help suck the warm water in as it expands. So the foam will expand due to the heat and as, it, as that's happening it will suck in the water which is also hot water which will help expand it. I mean I've tried this with um, foams I've taken out of tyres and they've looked completely squashed and misshapen but as soon as you put them in hot water they just puff right back to normal. And once done, you just have to put them on a paper towel and leave them till they dry out properly. I mean, it should already be formed already now. Doesn't take too long, maybe about 30 seconds. You can already see, looking at it from this angle, you can see it's already puffing out on the side of the tyre wall. Which it just shows that the uh, foams have already reinflated in the inside. Just a little trick, I don't know if anyone's really interested in that one, but it's there in case anyone's interested or doesn't know about it. 